Republican Committee. What you're looking at is an amazing piece of technology, it's electric vehicle, EVs. For some of my friends who have purchased them, they think it's the best thing they've ever done. And it may suit your lifestyle. For others, it may not at all. The key issue is you have that choice right now as to whether you want to buy an electric vehicle or not. For some, the cost may be too high. $65,000 for an average price of an electric vehicle, and many people cannot afford that. The key, though, is that it's your choice, and it's important. But if Governor Carney and DenRec have their way, they will be implementing the California emission standards. And from 2025 until 2035, it will be increasingly difficult to purchase anything but an electric vehicle until 2035 when there is a total ban. As I said, for some may feel this is wonderful, but for others, this would be a real challenge. The key is that the government should not be mandating to you an important decision about what type of vehicle you want to purchase. That should be your individual freedom. Over the next several months, we're going to be producing a series that's going to talk about electric vehicles. We're going to talk about the pros and cons of electric vehicles. We're going to talk about the supply of energy, electricity. You don't still flip a switch. It comes at a cost. And the challenges will be when you continue to put an increasing burden on the electrical grid, can the electrical grid supply the energy that you need? If you look at California, California emission standards, they have that trouble because they were telling EV owners, please don't charge your cars in toward certain times because they didn't have enough electricity. Now, that's a serious problem. So we want you to understand the complications of this issue. We want you to understand that electric vehicles may not be as energy free and energy clean as they claim to be. We want you to understand the problems of the batteries. All these issues are really important. It's important for you to understand the California emission standards because this may have come at a very heavy cost for you. So this is really a great opportunity for you to look at these videos, to look at our reference material. You can make your own decision. If you are impacted by this, if you're upset by this, then a call for action. Things you can do to turn this around. So we're excited about this. We hope you are too. And I appreciate you watching.